aggro. Oh my god, I love him so much. Everybody loves aggro, though. So I'm just assuming I got healed after that little affair, right? I don't need to, to pray. You'd think. Let's pray anyway. All right. Yeah, this one I don't remember where we're going, so it might take me a sec. There's, I feel like there's one or two bosses in this that I always just kind of get lost on, on where exactly I need to go. Oh, shit. That's not the, the right button. Yeah, I think there's one in particular where you have to, like, go into this forest or some shit, and I always take the wrong way. But who knows? Maybe I'll go through the entire game and be like, okay, I have no idea. <laughs> I have no idea what I was talking about. This riding angle is, uh, I understand they're trying to give me a little bit of scale, but I keep, like, just panning it down. Game said, no, that's not what we do here. I'm trying to make the world look massive. Oh, God, watch this be the boss that I'm, like, going to get lost somehow. Oh, we don't have a light, so it doesn't work. God, this section looks really cool, though. Please go faster, sir. Come on, buddy. He really does not want to go any faster here. Let's just walk for, for a second or two. Do we have a lizard to shoot? That is the other question. I'm going to look for him for like two seconds, but we're not going to spend too much time. This area looks really pretty until the lighting effects kind of bug out just a little bit. Or maybe it's de-rendering some uh, objects so they're not casting light or casting shadow. Yeah, I think this is the forest I, that I... Just get turned around hopelessly in for some reason. Because you can't use your little... Your little glow unless you're in the light. But not, not too hard to navigate. Right? No, this is a dead end. I think there's a, a lizard over here, actually. And I'm pretty sure we don't go down the cliff. That... Should be death, as far as I'm aware. Oh my god. Easy. Heck yeah. Alright, I guess we'll just follow the wall. Yeah, what the fuck? Definitely cannot drop down, right? Yeah, I think that's just a, a kill plane. Perhaps. Makes it feel like I should drop down. But we'll just, we'll follow the wall. I think this will lead me where I need to be. Maybe not. It do be saying straight ahead though. But yeah, that's a that's a pretty rocky drop. I mean This looks like the right path, right? No way this is like the exact way we entered this. Damn son, where's the horse? He's really having a time. 
hung up on all the plants back there. Yeah, this is the way to go. Okay, it's not that crazy that I got lost in there then. Because there's two spots that are kind of dead ends. And if you don't know that you can't drop down, I definitely would have tried to jump down. I mean, the prior fight just kind of informed us that you can fall into water and not get completely killed. Oh my god, how'd you come from that way? <laughs> Doesn't even make sense. Yeah, that's a, a little weird segment there. Oh my god. We're in the desert. It's not desert boss time though, I don't think. Maybe that's why I also got hung up because you have to come back this way to fight the snake thing. Pretty sure. So that's probably the, the two times or so that I got lost was going through the same path each time. Alright, sir, where are we going? Yeah. We have an entrance. That's the other thing is that the, the light kind of just shows you the direct route. Sometimes it ignores whatever might be in your way. Here we go. Now we're in business. Ow, my health. Wait, is this the dude with the beard? I thought the guy with the beard was like a later boss. Turns out I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about. Then again, when do I ever? We did the dive roll. Or is this the lizard? What is this? What are you? Damn, that's quite the drop. Yeah, I think this is Beard Man. Um, are these all rungs I can drop down on? Hey, there we go. Take the easy way down. Path of least resistance. Oh yeah, this is this is beard dude. This guy feels way earlier. I thought he was like second or third last or something. Oh, I'm thinking of a different guy. There's another like bipedal guy. <clears throat> it's pretty close to the end of the game. Yeah, this dude, uh, I don't know why. He, he just reminds me so much of the first, the very first boss that I don't remember him super well. On top of the fact that his gimmick isn't like anything too crazy. Oh my god, we got environment destruction. That was in the PS2 game? That's, this game's like insane on a technical level. Having like cloth and hair physics and some level of environment destruction in a PS2 game. Kind of kind of nutty stuff. Yeah, this dude I remember being incredibly easy. Pretty sure we just we just chill until he gives us uh, a chance to climb up. There we go. Fuck. Okay. We got the beard. Oop. 
Hey, I uh, I appreciate you stopping in, man. Do you have this game, Riker? Before you leave, unless you're already gone. But I appreciate it either way. Because this is a game I was not aware that... Okay, you do have it. Cool. Thanks for stopping in, though, man. Always appreciate it. Yeah, this boss pretty cut and dry. Maybe that's why I kind of, in my mind, misplaced him later in the game. Not a whole lot to, to remember here in general. Oh, yeah, we got a little meaty bit down here. Oh, nice. Yeah, I think you might be right. God damn. The lighting in this room is insane, too. Like when he was leaning forward and shaking. Yeah, look at that. Can I please kill? I would like to kill. Well, maybe we should have gotten a little bit more grip left. Maybe greeting's fine. If we need one hit here, then greeting's fine. If we need two, maybe it wasn't. I right, greeting was fine. Yeah, his design is is all right. I don't know. It feels too much like the first boss, for my liking. No, we can't run. Can't run from the goo. Alright, I hope they give us the... the desert boss right away here so that I can get that uh, forest segment out of my mind. I can just delete it from my memory and just throw it away. God damn, dude. There's so many. Two, four, six. Like halfway through the game. Alright, let's see what the next guy is. I do like that once you get into the game, they really let you just knock him out at a, at a pretty steady clip here. Damn, we've been going for an hour and a half. Can we beat this game in just one sitting? Hidden? Oh, this is the lake. <laughs> yeah, I do remember the mechanics of pretty much all the rest of them. So we should be... Should be golden. I think there's one or two remaining that I'm like, mm. don't 100% remember what what the play is. Oh, they fly off. I wanted to shoot the the symbols of hope and peace. Are you good? Are you good, Agra? Seven hours on average. I don't know. We're uh. We're knocking these guys out pretty quick. I guess that must that must be blind. I don't know, even blind I don't feel like this game is that long, right? Like 30 minutes per boss? Seems like pretty long. I mean, you're definitely not riding too much. There's a bit of riding to pad it out, but pad out 30 minutes. I've killed six bosses. Oh wait, this isn't where the... Oh yes it is. It is where the bridge is. Yeah. 
I mean, if there's 13, 13 Colossi, that puts you at like six and a half hours, right? If you're doing it 30 minutes a piece. Oh, there is 16. Just kidding. Why did I think there was... I thought there was 16 and then I thought there was... Thir I thought I was wrong and I thought there was 13. Just kidding then. Oh my god, aggro. You're fucking me up. Horse. I'm pretty sure we gotta go around this way, right? Just kidding then. Yeah, that's that's probably not not too far off then. God damn. Yeah, initially I said 16 and then I I second guessed myself and I'm like maybe there's only 13. But yeah, if you don't know the mechanics, especially, they can take a, a bit of time. Knowing the mechanics definitely helps. Am I going the right way? We got no sunlight. Is there a path out the other side here? Oh my god, aggro. He's all over the road. This horse, dude, he's insane. Holy shit. Overcorrecting super hard. Here we go. This has got to be right. Ah, uh, lizard. Hold on. Let me use the light beam. Not that way. Please, horse. Please. It is this way. Cool. He kept wanting to, to march ahead. Even when we were already at the wall. Is it this way? Faster, faster. Yeah, some of these back areas. I really don't remember the way. We're just going to bullshit our way through and hopefully we're going the right way. We have no light to work with. Mm. Might have wanted to go the other way. Now that I'm seeing this is going uphill. Not necessarily true, but generally uphill. It's not lead to uh, the origin of our water. Yeah, this uh, valley is huge cock block. There's no sunlight in here. We might have like a little pocket to see if we're on the right path. Let's check it right up ahead. God, the camera wants to pan down constantly. Even when we're riding, uh, when we're riding on hills as well. Damn. We really went the wrong way. I knew it halfway through. But I need the light to confirm. All right, should just be the other path, this junction up ahead. Hopefully. Yeah, this is a, I don't know, just the, the geography here is just so cool. Don't really mind that there's not a lot going on. Oh, watch. We were probably like two inches away from where we needed to be. Dude, this camera is fucking wild right now. At 
looks like we might still be on the right path here because we do have a turn. All right, what's popping up ahead? That's yeah. yeah, to the left, even more. Yeah. Now let's do a drive-by really quick and just see if we can see uh, a lizard hanging out. Mm, don't really see anything. Not gonna be too specific about it. Right, up and over, and I think we're at our destination. Let's take a peek. Oh yeah, here we are. Oh my god. He really doesn't want to be in that in that tight little walkway there. Oh, now he's cooperating pretty well. Not going super fast, but fast enough. Holy fuck. Catapult ourselves. I mean, down's probably the way to go, but let's just take a quick peek. I want to see if I can see him up from up here. I don't think we can. They did give us a sick diving board, though. All right, this is a boss that I kind of remember the gist of how it goes, but not 100%. So we're going to find out pretty quick here. I know I need him to surface, but I don't remember how to make him do that. This is a really cool looking enemy though. I like his uh big whiskers. Sir. Can I please get out of the water. Does he know we're here? Don't arrows like not travel through water? No. That's not gonna help us here. Very bold of them to create a, a water-based enemy. I mean, it, it makes sense, but... A lot of times in, in setups like these, where your control is so limited in the water, oftentimes not, not as fun of a time. We're just a little late. Damn. We barely missed him. We'll get him on the next pass. I do like that those little uh, electric spires kind of indicate where the tail is going to pop up. Dude, this is like someone's biggest fear. This exact scenario. I don't have red eyes on him. I'm not sure if he knows exactly where I'm at. Come on, buddy. Oh, is he coming up? Getting pretty high up, but not quite. I really need him to notice me. Oh, I guess, I guess that was enough. <laughs> we were like right in front of him. A number of times, but that's what really did it. Being somewhat near. Yeah, we don't want to get shocked. Oh my god, are we late again? Oh, my lord, dude. Ugh, I know exactly where I need to be, but... The electricity is scaring me off. I think I maybe need to... Probably can get closer than the electricity makes it look like I can. 
I don't know, especially with how the, the camera is here, it's hard for me to line it up to. Diving, a, a better way to get his attention? Maybe it is. He uh, got pretty pissed pretty quick there. All right. Where's my mark? Oh my god, we're so far away. Dude, we're fucked again. It's so hard to judge the depth. Quite literally. But I mainly mean how far away we are from him because there's no, there's nothing to reference. It's like uh, Four Kings. Not a lot to visually reference. Come on, sir. Please get mad. Oh my god. Ugh. This sucks, dude. Oh, we have like a center camera button? I don't understand. Now he's pissed, I guess, but that's fine. That's what we want. Okay, here we go. Really close to this shit. Ow. Hey, as long as it works, that's all I care about. Oh my god, it's so dark. You please surface. Thank you. Yeah, I really don't want to fall off him here. That would be a, a very bad time. How do we not get zoinked in the water? With the rush. Oh my god, please. That's okay. Just a little electricity, not a big deal. There we go. We hit the off button. Does this deal any extra damage here? Or is that all we get out of it? That's all we get. All right, that's fine. Yeah, I don't know. It felt really tight trying to get on him the first time without taking any damage. We push the off button again. That wasn't a full charge, so I'm going to try one more hit just to see if we get more damage. We don't. It's either all or nothing. All right, it's Twilight Princess. Can we please go to the surface, sir? Oh my God. God damn, dude. Or is that just a force off? Just make me get off. Dude went pretty, pretty deep there. Hello. You wish to come after me, don't you? Oh my God. How does he not? How does he not notice me? Come on. He's probably about to notice me. I guess his, his eyes are on the side of his head. That's how he's not noticing me. Is that really the... The logic of why it perhaps isn't working, working quite how I want it to? There we go. Man, the, the lightning to guide you is pretty convenient. Very hard to see when we don't have that. 
All right, dude, I'm going to run out of stam if we don't we don't surface in a hot sec. For the love of God. Oh my God, that was so close. Please. Please poke out. Do the one thing that'll let me kill you. Perfect. We're getting there. Almost. Uh, if we have to do this again, I'm going to be very sad. It right, should be one more surface here. All right, there's the off button. Oh, no. Please just let me murder you. Really good damage. Holy fuck, we barely grabbed. I'm trying to conserve some semblance of stam. Oh, our alignment's so bad. We probably don't need a full charge. Oh, that first hit just dealt extreme damage. The subsequent ones, not as much. Although I'm having trouble positioning myself on this thing. It's not bode well. There we go. That's a little bit better positioning. I know it's it's pretty generous. We don't have to be so specific. Holy shit, get me out. Yeah, I don't know. I don't like that fight as much. Because you can't really prompt the boss. You just kind of have to wait for it to notice you. I don't know. There were times where I felt like it should have noticed me and it didn't. Times where I felt like it shouldn't have and it did. But I guess its eyes are on the side of its head. But even then. That kind of justified the last one. But there were one or two where it noticed me and I was like, what the fuck? I don't know, I, I would prefer the bosses where you can use your bow to kind of prompt them to do stuff. Get their attention that way. Come on, where's the juice? There it is. <laughs> Took us a hot minute to get sauced there. All right, that was number seven, I believe. Oh yeah, I suppose there are a lot of bosses left. There's a lizard. There's like the other humanoid guy. There's a dude who dashes into the pillars. There's the boar. There's the last one. And there's two more I can't quite recall. It's, I'm pretty sure that's how that fight works as he bonks the pillars over. I guess we'll find out when we get there. Yeah, there's a lot of different locales in this. If they if they did populate the world with enemies and shit, that would be a fuck ton of work. Tail trapped within a pail. All right. Interesting. Interesting way of uh, describing what's going on. This, I don't remember who this is, so we're going to find out. But his tail is trapped in a pail. 